Hey everybody, I'm here today to talk to you about six things to do after you get your license. Now getting your license is a big deal and you may think that as soon as you get your license you're like, wow, congrats to me, I'm done. But there are actually a few other things that are very important to do and get done once you've actually received your license. So let's get right into it. The first thing, and these aren't in an exact order, these are just six things that you should do in whatever order that you please after you get your license. But the first thing is to congratulate yourself. So like, I would consider this to actually be the first thing that you should do. As soon as you get your license, congratulate yourself because you know what? It probably took a lot of hard work. So you deserve a congratulations. Congratulate yourself and tell your friends and family members that are close to you because most likely they're going to want to congratulate you too. So congratulate yourself and receive the congratulatory um, sayings and phrases from your family and friends. The second thing that you want to do after you get your license is get insurance. So here's the thing. It's important to get the proper insurance in order to drive. I mean, you don't want to get your license and then just think that you can just get into a car and drive a car without being insured. So get insurance. You want to call your insurance company, figure out what kind of plan or policy you need and get the appropriate insurance. Number three on the list is to thank your driving instructor. Now, this is obviously if you went through driving school. If you didn't go through driving school, then you can't really thank your driving instructor. But if you did, then thank them for everything that they've done for you. There's a good chance that your driving instructor played a huge role in helping you pass your driving test and get your license. So give them a huge thank you. You know, call them, tell them thank you. Maybe send them uh, like a, you know, a bouquet of flowers or something. Send them something nice as a thank you for helping you get your license and giving you the skills that you need to actually be a safe driver. The fourth thing that you should do after you get your license is keep on practicing. So many people think that as soon as they get their license, the practicing ends right there. It does not. It definitely does not. I have had my license for more than 15 years and I still practice on a daily basis. Once you get your license, the practicing does not stop. Just like any other skill in life, if you don't use it, you lose it. Meaning if you don't practice your safe driving skills, you're probably going to lose them over time. So keep on practicing. Number five is finish your paperwork. Now, when you get your license and the examiner tells you that you've passed, you know, you probably still have to take care of some paperwork. You probably still have to go and maybe get a picture taken for your driver's license. You probably have to go and fill out the stuff to actually get your driver's license card or paper. You might have to get a temporary driver's license depending on where you live. You also have to do your insurance paperwork. Like I said, maybe ownership if you're going to buy a car. Take care of all of your paperwork. Now, there's probably going to be quite a bit of paperwork to take care of. It might be overwhelming, so just finish up your paperwork. Last but not least, number six on this list is to learn more about road safety. Now, just like you got to keep on practicing your skills, there are a lot of things that are not required for your driving test with regards to road safety. Meaning, on your driving test, you're probably going to take your test, and obviously you've passed if you get if you're watching this video you're watching what to do after you get your license I'm sure that you've passed but there are a lot of road safety rules driving etiquette rules and unwritten rules of the road that you need to learn about and follow so go and find a good driver and figure out you know ask them what are some of the road safety things that you should know about and hopefully they can help you and do some research watch some videos look at some websites to figure out all of the road safety things that you should know about and that's basically it in this video I've gone over over six things to do after you get your license. Just to reiterate them, number one, congratulate yourself. Number two, get insurance. Number three, thank your driving instructor. Number four, keep on practicing. Number five, finish your paperwork. And number six, learn more about road safety. If you liked the video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Let me know what you think down below as a comment. And of course, be sure to subscribe for more great car and driving videos just like this one. And that's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching.